What's up, everybody? Uh, I'm Michael, and today we're gonna go for a run at Craven's house. It's nasty. It's raining. It's the uh, 30th of November today, and it's been raining here. It's about 55, 56 degrees. Um, I'm probably gonna get rained on when I get out there, but before I went out there, just wanted to show you some shoes. I got some new shoes. I'm pretty excited about those. I've got, this was my old pair. This is the Trail Talon 290 Innovates. Um, I've got almost 500 miles on these shoes. These are the shoes I was wearing at Upchuck, and they are great shoes, but I had a little bit of a blowout at Upchuck. I finished the race with that going on there. Uh, it started with a little spot, and from that little spot, it just kind of grew a little bit, and I had that spot on the shoe for a while, and then I guess once I hit the trail, I hit some stuff, and boom, busted them out. Sucks, because these are some of my favorite shoes, but hey, hey, all right, let's unbox these suckers. Ta-da! Awesome stuff. Bring them out of there. Ooh, yeah. Pretty. So I got these shoes at fast break in chattanooga i'll send a message to mike say mike i need i need a pair of shoes this is what i need and they take care of it uh, i get online i go to innovate and then i just kind of find which one i want at innovate when i find the one i want on innovate.com i just send him that picture and say this is this is the one i want uh, if you get that for me uh, i don't buy shoes online mainly because i feel like it's really important to support your local running store. If you have one, you should be buying shoes through them and not online because the online people that you don't know and you don't see on a regular basis, they're not working aid stations for you. That's just the way it is. They're not coming out, they're not supporting you, they're not having group runs, um, they're not talking to you about nutrition, they're not doing any of that. They just take your money and say thanks. Uh, as long as you go through a running store, you're giving a little bit of that money back to your running community, and I think that is very important. So, with that being said, don't buy your shoes online. Buy your shoes at your local running store. We have multiple here in Chattanooga, both of which I frequent. I try to spend as much money as possible in both stores. So, uh, I go to Fleet Feet a lot for nutrition and stuff. Um, I go to fast break for my shoes and and other things i mean i just clothing apparel all of that spend money in your local running store it's important they need your business they want to help putting races on they want to they want to continue to support you so you should continue to support them really excited to be in those trail talent 290s uh, i love these shoes like i said my second pair of those innovate is probably my favorite brand i buy innovates all the time you can see in the back of my nasty dirty truck i've got some rock lights back there um, those were not my favorites uh, i hike in those more than i run in those uh, i will say when it comes to shoes you're gonna you're gonna strike out before you find the one you want you're gonna get some shoes you're gonna pay a lot of money for them and you're gonna go man this these are not these are not what i thought they were gonna be they're I don't like them or maybe they're giving you um, blisters and stuff and you just can't stand them well you're gonna have to go buy another pair of shoes and you're gonna have to keep doing that till you find a pair of shoes that actually works for you um, I know people that have gone back and forth multiple times on shoes so I've done ultras and man Sauconies. I think I did some Brooks at one point. I've just done. I've done a lot of different. I've tried Solomon. I want to love Solomon shoes. I just can't. Um, their their gear is phenomenal. I wear Solomon stuff all the time, but I just can't. I can't get into the shoes. 
their vests are top notch, their clothing's top notch, but yeah, not a big Solomon shoe guy. Um, so I landed on Innovate. Innovate might be your jam, might not be your jam. Uh, that's cool, but find a local running store that will support what shoes you want and buy from them. Yeah. So this is a beautiful view of Chattanooga. Aww. All right, so we've got a couple of races coming up. We've got the Lookout 50 and 20 miler. I'm gonna run one of those. I can't decide which one yet. Uh, 20 for sure, 50 maybe. And then Mountain Mist in January. So that's what I've got coming up. Um, tell me in the comments below what kind of races you have coming up. If you're in Chattanooga, you have any questions, hit me up in the comments below on that. Um, subscribe to the channel, like the channel, hit the little bell so you see when I put videos up. And yeah, reach out. Let's go for a run. Let's go, uh, let's get in the woods together. Awesome. Thanks, guys.